What's up guys, Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and in this video, we're going to take a look at an awesome application in Cydia called Bridge. Now this is actually a first of its kind application, and what it allows you to do is to transfer music that you've downloaded on your device into your music app, into your library. So this is a very cool application. Now, like I said, it doesn't allow you to actually download the music, it's simply a bridge to transfer the music to it. So you will have to use a different method to download music. You can use Safari Download Manager. I believe there's a download manager for the Chrome application. And for this demonstration, I'll be using Pandora Downloader. As you can see, the uh, downloader is right next to the Pandora app itself. Now, I've actually done a review on that application. So if you want to see more about Pandora Downloader, check the description. I'll leave the link for the video there. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and open up Pandora Downloader, and I'll be using the song Always by Blink-182 for this video. So I have it downloaded. It's in my music kind of folder in Pandora Downloader. All I gotta do is exit the application, head over to Bridge, go ahead and launch it. Let me back out here so you guys can kind of get an idea of what's going on. So here's the home page. Just a little bit about the uh, application. There's a set of instructions right here. Now basically to find your music, you're gonna have to get used to using this kind of like little finder through your files. It's almost like an extension for iFile in its own way. Now, I know where the Pandora Downloader music goes, but if you're using Safari Download Manager or Chrome Download Manager, it's going to be in different kind of spots, so you will kind of have to explore around a little bit. So, uh, Pandora songs are downloaded to are downloaded to the Pandora folder right here, and then there is always.mp3. I'm going to go ahead and select that. Now here, it gives you a couple of options. It could be a song, or you can transfer it even into your ringtones in settings, or even if it's a podcast. Now you can also edit the title of the song, the artist, the album, and the genre. And also if you want album artwork, you can actually save an image from Safari into your camera roll and select an image for the album artwork. Now I'm OCD and I love having the album artwork, so I've already selected the image. And just a little tip on what kind of images work best for the album artwork. First, you're going to want to make sure it's perfectly square, for example, 500 pixels by 500 pixels. Another thing is if you're on a Retina device, I'd recommend the smallest image you use is 500 pixels by 500 pixels. Anything less than that and it's probably going to look kind of fuzzy. So here to select the image to make your album artwork, you're going to go ahead and click select image. You go to media and then your album is in DCIM 100 Apple. Now to make this easier on yourself, just make sure the last image that you saved or that's in your camera roll is the album artwork and then it's going to be all the way at the bottom. So there's the album artwork I'm going to be using. Now normally I would fill out the artist and album and genre stuff, but just for this video I'm just going to go ahead and click import and bypass that. I've actually tested this a couple of times. Now transferring it into your music library does take a minute. As you can see the loader bar isn't going incredibly fast. It does take a little bit. So I'm just going to fast forward this part. And then once it's done transferring it, you can go ahead and exit bridge. Go ahead and open up your music application. Now keep in mind guys, I've done this a couple of times just to get it right and figure out how exactly it was working. So this is the song right here. And there you go. That's how you transfer it. Now Bridge is a paid application. It is a $1.99. It is compatible with iOS 5 and iOS 6. In this video, I am on iOS 6. If you guys want to see how to jailbreak iOS 6, you can go ahead and click that annotation right there, or you can even uh, check the description. I'll have the link there. Now back to Bridge. Bridge is Cydia's first standalone application that allows you to import music and video straight to your media library. And uh, just one thing to keep in mind is if you connect your iDevice into your computer and try to transfer the music out of your library onto your computer, it will not work. So let me know what you guys think about Bridge down in the comments. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to throw me a thumbs up. That helps out a lot. Also, if you have any questions, you can go ahead and comment below. And if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to click that subscribe button. This is Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and I'll catch you guys later.